So, you're not going to believe this. I thought I'd turn up early for the um, for the retreat that I'm on this week, and I thought that I would drive up to Wales, have some time at Newquay. Um, initially, I was going to drive up on Friday, then I was going to drive up on Saturday, then eventually I was like, right, I'm driving up on Sunday. So I drove up on Sunday, stayed over the night in Newquay, had a wonderful time on the beach this morning. Um, Cody, oh my God, he's fast asleep in the back there. Back there, back there, there, there he is. Um, he had an amazing time on the beach this morning. Um, he made loads of friends. And I did that thing where you're self-editing, so taking a video and pressing the pause button to to sort of like, you know, cut between shots and things. And uh, I took 45 minutes of pocket video because I pushed the pause at the wrong time. Um, not only that, I've already recorded this message once without pressing record. <laughs> So I'm just looking down and going, it is recording this time. It is recording. I'm doing okay. But I'm having one of those mornings. So um, so had a lovely time on the beach. Got back to the van. Had some breakfast. Or had a lovely walk on the beach this morning at 5am, um, before 5.30, before anyone else was really awake. Met a couple of people at about 6, 6.30. Um, and then went back, came back to the motorhome, had breakfast, um watched some dolphins and then headed back down again cody kept telling me when a dog was going past mom mom there's a dog it's going down to the beach we've got to go down to the beach to say hello to it and play with it so um we did that uh cody figured out how to open the door in the motorhome i shut him in the motorhome whilst i went and used the public toilets only to find that um i could hear something in the public toilets and realised that he had let himself out of the motorhome and he had made his way over to find me in the toilets. So now I'm going to have to lock the motorhome every time I need to go anywhere. Uh, anyway, then came back to the motorhome, set up everything, ready to go and um, get to the retreat. Made sure I was coming the right way to the retreat because... There's two routes and one is a very, very steep, sharp curve, curve, angle in the road that you have to make and go uphill at the same time. The old girl was not going to make that. I've struggled in in my car before doing it. So um, I made sure I was coming the right way, got here, arrived at the at the at the um, the house and thought, oh, this has been, they've done a load of lovely work out the front. The car park is bigger and it's much smarter and everything. Looking good, looking very good. I'll pull over into this corner right here, out of everybody's way, messaged um, Caroline <laughs> to say I'm here a little bit early because it was only 12 o'clock. Um... Lady came out from cleaning. I said, oh, don't worry about me. I said, I'll stay in the motorhome until my room's ready. Don't worry. And she went, are you, are, you, you, you're, are you staying up in one of the other fields? I think you're in the wrong place. I said, no, 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 I'm here for Caroline's retreat. She looked at me and she said, it doesn't start until tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> okay. So that's another mistake. <laughs> So I thought the retreat was on Monday to Friday. It's apparently it's on Tuesday to Sunday. So um, that's um, I've just had to break that to Brian, which was was not great. But he's I'm pleased to say that he's he's so good. He's so incredibly good. So he's back at home holding the fort with the girls and um, and making sure everything runs smoothly whilst I'm away. Oh, poor poor. Poor man, poor man. Oh, what can you say? When menopause hits, you just, your brain just goes to frazzle, doesn't it? Anyway, so then I go to reception and I say, I'm, I've made a big boo-boo. So um, I said, I'm in the motorhome. They, were say, they said to me, that's okay, we can, we can, what, do you need to stay somewhere? I said, I'm in the motorhome. I just need to go and find somewhere that's a flat surface so that I can sleep for the night. I said, that's all I need. He's, they said, oh, we've got some sites with some 
um, plugins and stuff. I said, no, 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 don't worry about plugin and everything. I said, I, I just literally want a flat surface to park up on. Um, I did contemplate, shall I go back to New Quay? It was lovely down there. And then I thought, well, I'm here now. So, um, so we have parked up at the top of this of a field where behind me is um a little hedge <laughs> but there's a gap in the hedge and that leads you through to composting toilets and some lovely showers in like um a big cabin type thing and then this field here it looks like i've pretty much i know there's a van parked there but it, i think it's just parked there i've pretty much got this place to myself what a lovely view so when the when he wakes up i'll take him for a wander around but i'm here at the <laughs> at the retreat a day early and um i think i'm going to make some most of the most of it and oh, lie down and have a bit of a kip i'll see you later bye <laughs>